Coastal Assemblies of God, Kenya. I thought it's wise today to mutually ask every one of us here to celebrate with me one part of my life. That is education achievements. Apart from spiritual growth, God admonishes every human to build oneself in the knowledge that leads to maturity and leading a life of responsibility. Paul of the Bible recognizes that as he writes his epistles to Timothy to remain wise in studying and maturing without any hesitation of being provoked or intimidated. At last, brethren, I graduated last year, 2023, on 27th December with a philosophy doctor in Christian counseling philosophy, psychology, from Evangel Christian University of America, a university that, that has clear virtues on Christian ethics and vision that balances biblical doctrines and life, life in general. It is the same university that a few years ago I graduated from the master's degree with the master's degree in education in Christian education and after Shalom's Shalom master's degree on the same education faculty. This journey has been realized from the time I entered Nyangori for my diploma courses in Bible and theology in the 90s and later joining Pan Africa Christian University for the bachelor's degree in theology, then proceeded to the level I have mentioned. Celebrate with me on this achievement and thanking God for the breakthrough he has tirelessly given me despite the odds of life. As part of the report of the Kothari Commission, the destiny of any country is being shaped in education. According to Kothari, education in grain civil and social responsibility among everyone. Therefore, in order to bring unity, education is a means for emotional integration. We can not do without any kind of education. Education is an essential aspect of human development. Education is a means of achieving a world of peace, justice, freedom, and equality for all. Thus, education is extremely necessary for all. No good life is possible without education. Today, I thought it wise to ask all of us to have a par paradigm shift in our life apart from the church ministries. This aims at a holistic and a dimensional life that make every person in the planet to enjoy what was created in him. For life is the place of God in the form of trust that we, that we will make it meaningful in whatever we can. We are all unique individuals. No one is born in no one is born like you, and no one will ever be. So cherish your individuality. Many times I come across people accusing God of things that they don't have. They always they are always cursing their lives. But do they realize that this life itself is precious? If we make it worth living and work hard toward post positive. Brethren, life is nothing but a journey with lessons, hardships, heartache, and, sp and special moments. It will ultimately lead us to our destination, our purpose in life. The road will not always be a plain. In fact, throughout our travels, we will face many challenges. These challenges will always test our courage, strength, weaknesses, and faith. Along our way, we may encounter obstacles, obstacles that will come between the path that we are, we are destined to take. In order to be on the right path, we must overcome these obstacles. Sometimes, these obstacles are really blessings in disguise, only we don't understand that at that at the time. The secret of life is best known to those who are not attacked to anything deeply so much. Therefore, they remain out of touch with worries and the shifting fortunes of their lives. 
they are the people who do not measure their lives in terms of materialistic possessions, but by, by measuring their lives in terms of people they cannot live without. With this in mind, therefore, I will conclude that we should make life worthwhile. It should be with the love of our families, family and friends that life can be made beautiful. Life can be more beautiful and purposeful by discharging our duties in our families, at work, society, and the world at large. I encourage all of us to take a step to continue studying formally or informally so that even with our, with our church and secular ministries, life can be more meaningful and more interpretive for God's glory. Colleagues, colleges, univers universities that are accredited like Evangel Christian University of America is a place for you to be. Celebrate with me on this achievement today as it will be for you tomorrow. May God bless you. May God bless all of us. I want to wish you well and thank you for coming. God bless you. Amen. <laughs>